how to send facebook leads to telegram channel automatically so assume that you are running ads on facebook for which you have created a facebook lead ad form now whenever a new lead is captured via that form i will show you how you can send the same lead to your telegram channel automatically so if you also want to share your leads with your team on telegram then come with me and i will show you everything step by step so this is my facebook lead ad form and in order to send these leads to telegram channel firstly i'll have to build an integration in facebook and telegram application which i am going to do with the help of software called as pabli connect which is an integration and automation software and i am an existing user of pabli connect so that is why i am already logged in you can create your free account in pabli connect in just 2 minute from the sign up free button and in the free account you will also get free task to test this kind of amazing automation now once you will log in and reach out to the dashboard of pabli connect click on this blue button that is create workflow and then provide a random name to your workflow to your automation okay so i have directly pasted the name as this that is send facebook leads to telegram channel and have clicked on that create button and here you can notice two boxes so these boxes are called as trigger and action and here the trigger means when this happens an action means do this so whenever something happen in the first application then automatically do this in the next application so this is how you need to always choose the application in this trigger and the action window in which you are building an automation okay so according to our use case we want that whenever any new lead is captured via facebook lead ad form then automatically send this lead to telegram application okay so in this way i have selected both the application in the trigger and the action window and then idea here is I will be connecting both the applications one by one with the Pabli Connect. So let us first connect our Facebook lead ad form with the Pabli Connect. So firstly, I will select the trigger event that is new lead instead because I want to perform the same that whenever a new lead is submitted in specified lead generation form associated to your Facebook page, this automation should trigger. So I have selected the same. Simply clicking on connect, then clicking on add new connection, clicking on connect with Facebook lead ad button, and then you. Will have to provide the access of your Facebook account because I am already logged in in my Facebook account, so the authorization is successful, and that is how the Facebook lead ad account is connected with the Pabli Connect. Now, because my Facebook account is connected, whatever the pages are available inside my Facebook account have started visible here. Okay, so this is the pages section of my Facebook, and all these same pages are visible here. and i am going to select that ayurvedic spa page which i would like to connect with the pabli connect okay so i have selected the same that is ayurvedic spa let me search for the same page here also that is ayurvedic spa okay and now i'll show you the form which is available in this specific page firstly i'll be clicking on this more tool section clicking on this meta business tool then i'll be clicking on the all tool section after that that you will find the option of instant forms at the last okay and here exactly you will find the lead ad form here you can notice two forms are available inquire now and sign up now okay sign up form okay so i will be selecting this inquire now okay so the same form has been selected now i'll be clicking on this button save and send test request and first to read the instruction it is saying basically an important note is given here Please note that after clicking on the save and send test request button you will need to make a sample submission of your lead generation form by clicking on the preview form button and filling out the form okay so because i am not running any live advertisement i am working into the testing mode so that is why i am going to make a sample submission with the facebook lead ad testing tool only okay you can find the link of that testing tool from this particular doc documentation okay so here i will show you the link of that facebook lead ad testing okay so this is the link simply click on that 
link and you will be redirected to the facebook lead ad testing tool okay and with the help of this tool only we are going to make a dummy submission in our facebook lead ad form and from here firstly you will have to search for your page which was ayurvedic spa okay i have selected the same further you will have to select your form and then finally click on this preview button and this is how your facebook lead ad form will open here you just need to provide some sample data and click on this next and submit button and this is how a dummy lead will be generated via this facebook lead ad testing tool okay so give me a second so I have provided some random details, something like demo user as the name of the person, demo user at pablitudes.com as the email address. Here I also have provided a phone number and gender as female, clicking on next button, clicking on submit button. And once the submission is done here, you can notice your test lead has been generated. I will come back to Pabli Connect and will wait for the response. And here you can notice in front of you, the response is also received. Okay. Let me show you the details one by one. Here you can find the same random name, the same dummy email address, the same phone number, the gender. We also have the date and time. Okay. So the presence of this data clearly shows that the connection in between Facebook and Pabli Connect is working absolutely fine. So now onwards, what will happen? Every time someone will submit your Facebook lead ad form, basically this specific form, the details of that person will be captured via Pabli Connect instantly because this trigger will instantly capture new incoming data and the workflow execution will start in real time okay so in this way the first step of our workflow is done and moving further I am going to send these lead details to telegram channel that too automatically okay so the application is already selected now I will be selecting the action event that is send a text message or reply okay now simply clicking on connect then clicking on add a new connection and for the connection it is asking for the token so how you can get this token you will have to firstly search for the bot father in your telegram channel so give me a second let me search for the bot father here okay so this is my bot father now as per the instruction I am going to type the slash new bot to create a new bot okay so let me copy the same and I will paste the same thing here here and pressing enter and this is how you will notice it will say that all right a new bot how are we going to call it please choose a name for your bot okay so here i am going to provide a random name something like lead add testing okay i'm providing this particular name pressing enter and this is how the bot will be created now it is asking that now let's choose a username for your bot it must end in bot like this for example and here you can notice an example is already given here okay so i will be copying the same name here and will add underscore bot at the end pressing enter and this is how you will receive the token okay so this is the token Token. you can simply copy that token and paste it here clicking on save and this is how your telegram channel will be immediately connected with the Pabli connect so here you can notice it is connected now it is asking for the chat id so you will have to provide the id of that chat that channel that group in which you would like to send the lead details okay so here you can notice i have created this telegram group already and there are 14 members available in this telegram group okay so i can copy the id from the url or this group okay so i have copied the same give me a second and let me paste the same here okay now before we provide further details here firstly you will have to do one more very important setting okay so whatever the bot you have created just now you will have to firstly add that bot as the member of this specific group okay and then you will have to make that bot as an admin of this group okay so currently there are 14 members I'll be clicking on this plus icon and will search for the same bot which was something like lead ad testing okay give me a second 
okay so here we have the same bot i have selected the same clicking on this arrow button and this is how the same bot will be added as a member of my group now after that i will also have to promote this bot as an admin of this group but that is only possible with the telegram mobile application this setting is not available in the telegram web application okay so give me a second let me change the permission of this bot and then i will come back so I have changed the permission of this bot and now you can notice that this bot is now admin of our group. Okay. So finally, we will be able to send the messages on this specific telegram group because now our bot is the member of this group. Okay. Coming back to Pabli Connect dashboard and further it was asking for the text message. Okay. So from here exactly, I'm going to compose the message which I would like to share with my team. Okay, so firstly, I am going to write something like hello team members. Okay, so let me show you, let me tell you whatever I am going to write here. These details will remain same and will send to my telegram group as it is. Okay, but whatever the details I will map will be replaced automatically. Now I'll show you about mapping. What is this mapping all about? Okay, give me a second. So hello team members, a new lead has just got captured from our Facebook ad or I can also write Facebook uh, lead ad form okay I'm sharing the lead details here okay and here firstly I will add the name of the person name of the lead okay and as I have told you that we are going to map these details okay so mapping is very simple we are not going to basically manually copy the above data and paste below we are going to map this data how mapping can be performed when you will click on this field you will find the same data the above data here in the drop down simply select that data and this is how the data will be mapped okay in the same way I'm going to map other lead details also like the email address okay so give me a second let me map the same okay so again telling you whatever the details we have provided here manually will remain same but whatever the details we are mapping here will be replaced automatically when our automation will work in real time asking for the phone number okay so I have mapped the same and lastly I have the gender details okay so how about I add I map the same detail here which was something like feel okay so i think my message is looking good hello team members a new lead has just got captured from a facebook lead ad form i'm sharing the details here the lead details here name email phone number okay try to convert this lead at your best okay and then all the best okay i hope my message is looking good now it is asking for the thread id reply to message well these fields are not mandatory so currently i am leaving all the data all the fields blank how about i click on the save and send test request button directly and now i will wait for the response okay here you can notice it is saying bad request chat and out form okay so let me show you what exactly we are missing so firstly you will have to click on this documentation okay here it will ask you the chat id so firstly you should visit this documentation because here it is clearly mentioned that when you are sending the messages on telegram group you will have to add this 100 as prefix along with your chat id but if you are sending the same messages on telegram channel you will have to provide the chat id in the same way okay so i think we are missing this 100 as prefix okay so let me add the same and now i will try to send this message once again okay so clicking on this button save and send test request fingers crossed waiting for the response and here you can notice this time the response is received and this time the response is also positive going back this was my group and here you can notice from the name of same word the message is received and this is the same message that is hello team members 
because a new lead has just got captured from our Facebook lead ad form. I'm sharing the details here. The name is here. The email address is here. The phone is here. The gender is here. Try to convert this lead at your best all the best. Okay. So the presence of this message clearly shows that our automation is working absolutely fine. And in this way, with the help of Pabli Connect, you can automatically forward your new Facebook lead to your Telegram group or to your Telegram channel automatically. You just need to create this automation inside Pabli Connect once. After that, you can sit back and relax because Pabli Connect will take care of all the tasks in the back end. You do not have to do anything manually. Just in case, if you want to access this workflow inside your Pabli Connect account, I will also attach the link of my workflow into the description box. So simply click on this link and then sign up for free into the Pabli Connect and then you will be able to access the same two-step workflow inside your own Pabli Connect account that too for free. Not just these applications, you can integrate multiple applications and automate your business with Pabli Connect. You can ask your queries at forum.pabli.com. My team will surely answer to your questions. This is the website of Pabli Connect. And for the latest updates of Pabli Connect and unique automation ideas, you can join our Facebook group that is formget.deals. If you have found this video helpful in any way, share it with your friends and colleagues and also help them to automate. To make their business like share and subscribe thank you for watching this video